Well, we just had an open training session yeah. out on the pitch, and we, we don't get a huge amount of training time, so it's just logical that we announced it, and it takes all the questions out and gives certainty to the, to the players and to the boys, and um, they know who's playing stuff. So, um, yeah, really excited for, for Saturday. In Six changes, how's the balance and sort of selection between the same side giving the guys a chance? Um, yeah, we obviously wants to bring some continuity from the last game against Australia, uh, but I'm aware that Gats has got a press conference on Thursday to explain combinations and selections, so I don't really want to step on his toes, but that's okay. Yeah. Yeah, he's just, he's just, um, getting his recovery in after his, his his slight injury that he got against Australia. So, um, yeah, he's on his recovery stage and um, we, um, it's just important he gets back for, ready for selection for the quarterfinal. No, no, it was great. It was great, wasn't he? He came off for nine minutes um, and that just shows how quickly things can happen in the game and the guys on the bench have got such an important role to be, to be ready to go straight away and even the guys who aren't in the 23, uh, so much can happen between the Monday and the, and the weekend got to know your roles and be able to be ready to step in at any moment and that's the strength of this squad it's the 33 it's not just the 15 that start yeah just managing his load um, he's done an enormous amount of work um, him and Thomas um, the two nines so just making sure that he's, he's right for the weekend in terms of the group you one point atop it now you know that how do you approach this game against Jordan well we want to win the game um, we want to carry the momentum of the last you know four weeks um, and really um, we established the work that we've done over those three weeks so we understand the, the, the threat Georgia pose uh, we understand what happened in Cardiff you know, 11 months ago the performance they put in against Fiji at the weekend um, I know one of their coaches very well he's a good friend of mine um, and he'll have them absolutely firing on Saturday afternoon that's for sure yeah yeah I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and meet up for a coffee on Friday and get some secrets out of him but uh, no, he's a good friend, and I think he did a great job last week. Well, over the last few weeks, but especially against Fiji, uh, to nil them at half time was, was a fantastic effort. All the threats they've got, um, and um, that's testament to him as a, as a person and as a coach, uh, how well they did. Yeah, excited. Obviously, any any opportunity you get at a stage this big is is, is very exciting. Uh, yeah, I'm just really looking forward to getting off the bench and making an impact and hopefully helping the team to, to get the win. Yeah, it's, um, the boys work so hard on the training field to get those, those moments right. Um, and, you know, we've had a, we've had a couple over the first few weeks, which is, which is pleasing for the, for the boys. Um, but it's the balance of the whole, the whole team, you know, whether that's attack, defence, kicking game, forwards. Everything has to be, you know, at a good score to, to, to win those games. Um, and I thought Australia it all came together. Um, but there's certainly areas to improve on, um, and we want to keep, keep getting better and better. Um, we've, we've got high standards now, and it's important we adhere to them, whoever we're playing. So, yeah, it was a step in the right direction. It's great to get five points, qualify, but uh, we've got unfinished business for the weekend. Yeah, it's, it's just it's just time together and, and building combinations and understanding about what we're trying to achieve. Um, but it, as I said, it comes it comes from good scrum ball, it comes from good line up ball, um, and then the clarity of what we're trying to do. The execution comes from the work we do on the training paddock, um, and I think the leaders have been brilliant. Um, Big Z, Gareth, and, and Sam have been fantastic. Our nines have been great as well, and our, our back our back five of the of the field as well have, have been great. So. We've all got our strengths, um, and it's important that, as a team, we, we, we allow those, those strengths to flourish um, on the biggest stage. And uh, it's been pleasing so far. But as I said, we're, we're, we're driving high standards. We want to be better for the weekend. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we know from I just got out of I know between 
start at uh, at um, Happy Team Gala or well, NS. Uh, yeah, Charlie knew at all. I'm a uh, team just for the gala announced. So, um, yeah, go back to the Gatti Dold Massa at Gulliavi. So, yeah, I just come around at at Gwald New with nothing to say now. Uh, yeah, boys are going to be honest. Um, you sang Gala, Niang and Anesh, you just got a momentum. You uh, helping me mint in a uh, merry tournament. Um, yeah, we're going to need just a team, team more uh, efficient. Uh, uh, yeah, need, need more high in rugby, so yeah, could be thinking about a a W. So. Thank you very much, everyone. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks.